Fans, are you ready to meet the field for the NASCAR All-Star Race? Transferring from the open, Clint Boyer goes after his first All-Star win in his 11th appearance after winning the fan vote. The Emporia, Kansas driver starts last in the field of 20. And the fan vote winner has won it before. He hopes to do it again. Matt Benedetto continues to shine in his first season in the historic Wood Brothers 21, giving the team its first open win and transferring to his first All-Star race. The Wood Brothers won the 96 All-Star race, so the 28-year-old from Grass Valley, California, hopes to get them their second. He rolls off 19. William Byron, the 2018 Cup Rookie of the Year, pulled away in Stage 2 of the Open to get the stage win and transfer to his second All-Star race. The 22-year-old from Charlotte says Bristol is one of his favorite tracks. Can he cash in on the million dollars from 18th starting position? Almirola's hot streak continues. After entering the Open on a six-race top-ten streak, he won stage one to transfer to the All-Star race. The 36-year-old from Tampa makes his third All-Star, uh, third appearance in the All-Star race and starts 17th. Those are the four drivers that transferred from the All-Star Open. Now, here's Adam Alexander with the drivers who pre-qualified for the All-Star Race. Thanks, Mike. Now all these guys have been sitting back and relaxing and watching the Open. But now it's time to strap in and get serious. Let's meet the drivers who are racing to rule these roads for that trophy and one million dollars. Eric Jones beat the track too tough to tame last year to earn his second All-Star start. The 2017 Rookie of the Year has wins at Darlington and Daytona on his resume. The Byron, Michigan native has two Bristol wins in the Xfinity Series. Driving the number 20 Joe Gibbs Toyota, here is Eric Jones. Arguably the hottest driver so far this season, Denny Hamlin looks to power his momentum into another all-star victory. The 2015 winner already has four checkered flags in his bag, including his third Daytona 500 trophy. Could the Chesterfield, Virginia native add a million dollars to his already impressive season? Driving the number 11 Joe Gibbs Racing Toyota, here is Denny Hamlin. Old seven time will be looking for number five tonight. The 83 time cup winner will look to write a storybook end to his final all-star race with a fifth trophy. El Cajon, California is his hometown, but the seven time cup champion has been at home just about everywhere, racing in his final all-star event, driving the number 48 Hendrick Motorsport Chevrolet. Let's hear it for Jimmy Johnson. NASCAR's most popular driver is chasing his first all-star win. The Dawsonville, Georgia native has a win in seven top fives under his belt this season. Will the Sirene make some noise tonight? A legion of fans sure hope so. Here is the driver of the number nine Hendrick Motorsport Chevrolet, Chase Elliott. No longer the young kid in the garage, Joey Logano will be making unbelievably his 10th All-Star start tonight. 
the 2018 Cup champion will look for his second All-Star win. And if you really want to feel old, the Middletown, Connecticut driver won Rookie of the Year honors back in 2009. Driving in the number 22, Team Penske Ford, here is Joey Logano. No one has had more of a roller coaster season than Ryan Newman, but the veteran from South Bend, Indiana, has plenty of experience on his side. The 2002 All-Star winner got it done in his rookie year. The Rocket Man will look to take off and bring home his second trophy. Driving the number six, Roush Fenway Ford, this is Ryan Newman. The champ is here. The defending cup champion is back on familiar turf. You'd be a fool not to bet on this Las Vegas native to add to his astounding 22 wins here at Bristol across all three series. Looking for his second all-star win. Here is the driver of the number 18, Joe Gibbs Toyota, Kyle Busch. Keselowski has won a lot of races, 32 to be exact, but the 11-year vet has yet to win this race. Tonight, all that could change. The Rochester, Michigan man knows success here at Bristol Motor Speedway, winning three cup races, including back in May. He rides in the number two Team Penske Ford. Here is Brad Keselowski. an improbable victory Sunday at Kentucky Speedway. Cole Custer dramatically punched his ticket to the All-Star race. The Southern California racer will try and become the third rookie to win on All-Star night. Driving the number 41 Stuart Haas Ford, here is Cole Custer. Bush is no stranger to hoisting the All-Star Trophy. The 2010 winner will be a favorite tonight on a track where he's had a ton of success. The Las Vegas native has won six times on this track in a cup car. Could he make it lucky number seven for Chip Ganassi Racing, the number one Chevrolet? Here's Kurt Busch. in the saddle again. Matt Kenseth looks to rekindle some magic in this event. The 2004 winner is always a threat to win one of these and lately it looks like he's starting to find his groove. The Wisconsinite will be starting in his 19th All-Star race. He's in the number 42 Chevy driving for Chip Ganassi. Here is... To say Kevin Harvick and his team are firing on all cylinders is an understatement. The Bakersfield, California driver comes into tonight's all-star race already with four victories this season. All-star wins in 2007 and 2018. The closer is looking for the hat trick. Driving the number four, Stuart Haas Ford, here is Kevin Harvick. Justin Haley describes himself as just a dirt racer from Indiana. Well, after tonight, he might just be a Hoosier millionaire. The 21-year-old raced his way into tonight's event with an amazing win last summer in Daytona, winning in just his third cup start. Can the youngster shock the world again? Driving the number 77 Spire Motorsports Chevrolet, here is Justin Haley.
after winning the last two Talladega races in thrilling style. Ryan Blaney now sets his sights on the All-Star Trophy. The High Point North Carolina native has quietly put together another solid season, notching seven top five finishes. The driver of the number 12 Team Penske Ford, say hello to Ryan Blaney. Bowman punched his all-star ticket last year with his first career cup win at Chicagoland Speedway. Already a winner this year at Auto Club Speedway, the showman looks to wow the crowd tonight at Bristol. Could the Tucson, Arizona native be the fourth driver to win in their first ever all-star start? He races for Hendrick Motorsports in the number 88 Chevrolet. Here is Alex Bowman. You never count out Martin Truex Jr. in any race these days. The Mayetta, New Jersey racer has 27 wins under his belt, but will be looking for his first on All-Star Night in this, his 10th attempt. And that win would come at a track that has, let's just put it nicely, not been too nice to Martin. But as we know, anything can happen on All-Star Night. In the number 19 Joe Gibbs Toyota, here is Martin Truex Jr. There you have it. That's the field. Now who will bump, beat, and bang their way to the checkered flag? And more importantly, $1 million. We'll find out soon enough, and I can't wait, Mike.